hey welcome to my channel if you're new here i'm tk and this channel focuses on attainable fashion beauty lifestyle and travel if you're one of my returning subscribers thank you so much for coming back another week for another video i couldn't do this without you all so this week's video we're gonna do our perfume september tray um i decided because I have all this perfume and I'm a lover of perfume and anything fabulous, I figured, hey, let's do every month I try seven fragrances and I show them to you all, whether I'm wearing them day, night, at you know, going out to dinner or even going to bed with it on. So I wanted to show you seven fragrances that I have on my September trade that I'm going to wear all month for September. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so I'm excited for this. My first perfume for my September tray will be YSL's Black Opium. Yes, YSL's Black Opium. YSL Black Opium is an iconic fragrance and it especially shines in the fall. As the weather cools, the night grows longer and intoxicating scent becomes the perfect companion for indulging in autumn festivities. This scent was, is a warm and comforting essence of the coffee that mingles with sweetness of the vanilla, creating an addictive and inviting aurora. The white floral undertones add a touch of elegance and femininity to the oriental gourmand fragrance. This fragrance is my idea choice for a chilly evening. Black Opium by YSL. It's my first fragrance on my September tray. Okay, guys, I'm excited for this next one. So my second fragrance for my September tray is Lancome Idol. Yes. This modern and sophisticated scent celebrates the season with its bouquet of velvety roses, jasmines, and soft white musk. The crisp air of the autumn enhances the allure of this fragrance, making it the ideal choice for those who seek to embrace their femininity and confidence. The luminous rose notes create an aurora of elegance while the velvety jasmine adds a touch of sensuality. The softness of the white musk brings a delicate and comforting aspect, perfect for the crisp autumn and autumn days and evenings. Lancome's item's captivating charm is a perfect accessory to elevate your fall ensembles. It excludes the sense of poise and sophistication. Guys, this is exactly why Lancome Item is my second fragrance for my September perfume tray. So, my third September fragrance for my September tray is again YSL, but this time YSL Libre. YSL Libre is a bold and floral perfume for women. The statement of the feminine fragrance for those who live by their own rules. Lavender essence of the France combines the sensual of the Moroccan orange blossom of their daring notes. Okay, now my next perfume, which will be number four for my September perfume tray is Tom's Ford Velvet Orchid. Yes, Tom Ford's Velvet Orchid. Tom's Ford Velvet Orchid emerges as it, it's captivating, it's luxurious, it's enticing, the tale of the honey, the exotic rum, the velvety orchid. Fall nights become more sexy with this fragrance. It exudes confidence and sophistication. The rich inviting honey notes create a sweet and warm aurora while the exotic warm rum adds a touch of mystery. The Velvety Orchid Accord crowns this fragrance with opulence and floral elegance. Tom Ford's Velvet Orchids become, it's, it's basically a showstopper of the choice of glamorous evenings and special occasions during the fall. This luxurious and seductive scent is best suited for those who embrace their individu individuality and aren't afraid to make a statement. That's why Tom Ford Velvet Orchid made number four for my September perfume tray. So, I know you're gonna be like, what? 
This is an oldie, but definitely a goodie. Coming in at number five for my September tray is Prada's Prada Candy. Yes, Prada's Prada Candy. Prada Candy, another gourmand pick. Prada's Candy has a sweet caramel top note that dries down into a benzoin. The white musk, the caramel note provides a sweet, rich aroma while the musk gives the scent of that warm undertone. As this fragrance dries down, the heart notes of vanilla and benzoin takes the center stage. This vanilla, this vanilla fragrance provides a creamy, powdery touch which gives the scent a comforting and cozy feel. Although the scent is an oldie, like I said, it's always a goodie in my collection. Prada's Prada Candy. It's made my number five fragrance for my September tray, guys. Okay, guys. So, for my number six fragrance, I bet you're going to be wondering, where is she going with this? What made her bring this one out? Guys, Gucci Memoir. Gotta have Gucci in your fall scent, guys. You gotta have Gucci. Harry Styles is the muse for this dreamy perfume from Gucci. This fragrance is a green and earthy. It features notes of Roman chamomile, carol, coral jasmine, and vanilla, which is a which the brand describes this as a universal and unisex fragrance. Gucci's fragrance story, the scent becomes an explorer of the power of memories, bringing them back from the past and making them present. The packaging comes from the past, inspired by an old Gucci perfume from the old 90s. I love this bottle. I love the packaging of this fragrance. Guys, that's why Gucci Memoir made my number six fragrance for my September tray. Okay guys, we're here. Number seven. This is the final perfume that will be in my September tray, September tray for this month. Had to say the best for last. This fragrance, this makes, it speaks woman. You are a woman with this fragrance. Chanel's Coco Mademoiselle. I guess you all knew that already. Coco Mademoiselle perfume from Chanel Paris gives a signature fresh oriental fragrance that enhances personal style and luxury. When you open this bottle, you get a whiff of an orange mandarin smell, orange blossom, and bergamot. The heart notes contains Turkish rose, jasmine, yang yang, and mimosa. The base notes feature vanilla, white musk, and tonka beans. Guys, I love this fragrance so much. I feel like such a grown woman when I have this fragrance on. This is a definitely a getter for you ladies. September, I will definitely be rocking this, putting more of a dent in this um, perfume. Again, Coco Mademoiselle, this is my seventh fragrance and final for my September perfume tray guys. I want to thank you all who stayed to the end of this video. And remember, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And come back next week for another video. And again, I'm going to start incorporating these um, perfume hauls, which I showed them before on my channel, but I've just never really gone through my perfume. So I feel this is a way to go through seven perfumes through the month to show my perfume collection without making a long video showing all of my perfumes at once. So, like I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Love you all. See you in my next video. Bye.